Mother alligators also stay with their young and protect them for up to two years. However, many young die, and only one in 20 survives to adulthood. So, what is this part about? Uh, this part is, is about uh, what happens after the egg is hatched, alright? And how the babies uh, look like, and what the mother does to protect them, and things like that. The female doesn't sit on the nest like a bird, but she does remain close, close by to guard her eggs. She remains close by. What does by mean in that case, close by? By means next in that case, you understand? To guard her eggs. What does guard mean? Guard means to stay near and watch and protect something. Small animals like raccoons often try to dig up the eggs and eat them. Raccoons? What's a raccoon? Raccoon is a small animal which live, um, lives in the forest, alright? They have dark fur and their, their heads and their tails have stripes, white stripes. When the eggs are ready to hatch, the baby alligators start making chirping noises with which attract the mother. The baby alligators start making chirping noises. What's chirp? Chirping. Chirp means uh, making a short and high-pitched sound. Um, baby birds make it or small insects like crickets or um, grasshoppers. Chirp. You understand? Which attract the mother? What does attract mean? Attract means make something come near it. Okay? She digs up the eggs and helps them hatch. When they hatch, the small alligators are 8 to 10 inches long and are black with yellow uh, stripes. They are 8 to 10 inches long. What is an inch? One inch is like how many centimeters? Two point five centimeters, approximately. Okay. Uh, so a baby alligator would be how long? Like twenty centimeters, right? And they are black with yellow stripes. They are black and they have yellow stripes. What's a stripe? Stripe is a line, okay, of which the color is different from the area around it. That's a stripe. This color scheme helps them hide among vegetation from predators. This color scheme, what is scheme? Scheme is a plan, okay? So this color scheme means the structure of this color, all right? Helps them hide among vegetation. Vegetation, what does among mean? Among means within, all right? Surrounded by uh, vegetation, okay? From predators. What's a predator? Predator is an animal which hunts other animals and eat them, okay? Mother alligators also stay with their young and protect them for up to two years. So that means uh, as long as um, two years, okay? That's the longest. However, so she stays with the babies for two years, maximum. Many young die. However, many young die and only one in 20 survives to adulthood. However, what does that mean, however? However is uh, when you want to say something that contradicts and which is different from what you have just said. So it's like, but. Only 1 in 20 survives. 1 in 20, that means what? 19 dies and 1 uh, will survive. To adulthood. Adulthood. What does that mean? Hood means what? Hood means a state. 
Adulthood is the state of being an adult, all right? Let's go. Alligators' diets consist of small fish, shellfish, turtles, frogs, snakes, and animals that venture too close to the water. On land, they're slow, but in the water, they're quite swift. They normally lie in wait with only their nostrils and eyes above water. Check out the picture on page 49 in your texts. Look, you can barely see it, can't you? Suddenly, when its prey is near, the alligator strikes and grips it in its jaws. If its catch is small, the alligator eats it whole. But sometimes the alligator must crush it first. This is frequently the case for turtles or shellfish. For larger prey, such as deer, the alligator simply rolls over in the water and drowns its victim. But remember that alligators don't eat that often. They're cold-blooded, so they don't need food to maintain their body temperature. In fact, females can go for months without food while they're protecting their eggs. Do I Okay. So what is this part talking about? What alligators eat? Okay. Alligators' diet consists of small fish, shellfish, turtles, frogs, snakes, and animals that venture too close to the water. Alligators' diet? What is diet? Hold on. Oh my god. Diet is the type of food that someone or something regularly eat. You understand? Diets, alligators, diets consist of, what does that mean, consist of? If something consists of uh, something else, that something else is the part of that something. Do you understand? So if something consists of A, B, and C, A, B, and C forms something, the something. You understand? Small fish? Shellfish? What is shellfish? Shellfish is a small sea creature with a shell covering the body. Turtles? What's a turtle? Turtle is a large reptile having a um, thick shell to protect its body. Frogs, snakes and animals that venture too close. What does venture mean? Venture means um, they go to places where it might be dangerous. On land, they are slow, but in the water, they are quite swift. What does swift mean? Swift means fast, all right? They normally lie in wait with only their nostrils and eyes above water. They normally lie in wait. What does that mean? Lie in wait. Lie in wait means they hide somewhere and trying to uh, suddenly attack something, you understand? With only their nostrils and eye above water. Nostrils. What's a nostril? Nostril is the opening, the two opening of your nose, all right? Check out the picture on page 49 in your text. Look, you can barely see it, can't you? You can barely see it. What does that mean, barely? Barely means uh, it's only just the case. Do you understand? You can see it, but it's hard to see. So it's like hardly, you can hardly see it. Suddenly, when its prey is near, the alligator strikes and grips it in its jaws. When its prey is near, what is a prey? Prey is an animal that another animal is hunting and trying to eat. The alligator strikes. What does strike mean? Strike means attack quickly and violently and grips it in its jaws. What does grip mean? Grip means hold something firmly. You understand? In its jaws. What's a, what's a jaw? Jaw is the lower part of your face 
beneath your mouth. So this part is the jaw. If its catch is small, the alligator eats it whole. If its catch, what does that mean, catch? If its catch, the thing that it caught, all right? Is small, the alligator eats it whole. What does whole mean? Whole means all of it, you know what I'm saying? But sometimes the alligator must crush it first. Crush, what does that mean? Crush means to um, break it into pieces. This is frequently the case for turtles or a shellfish. This is frequently. What does frequent mean? Frequent means often. Okay, it often happens. This is frequently the case for turtles or a shellfish. Why? Because they have hard shell. You have to crush it. Alligators crush them with their jaws. For larger prey, such as deer, the alligator simply rolls over in the water and drowns its victim. For larger prey such as deer, the alligator simply rolls over. What does that mean, roll over? It means uh, change the position from where it's lying on one side to the other. You understand? And drowns its victim. What does drown mean? Drown means push something underwater and make it die because it can't breathe. Drowns its victim. What's a victim? Victim is a person or an animal that has been, been hurt or killed. It's a victim. But remember that alligators don't eat that often. They are cold-blooded, so they don't need food to maintain their body temperature. They don't, they don't need food to maintain. What does that mean, maintain? Maintain means uh, keep the same condition. Keep something in the same condition or state. Okay. Maintain their body temperature. What's the temperature? Temperature is the measure of how hot or cold something is. In fact, females can go for months without food while they're protecting their eggs. Females can go for months. What does that mean, go? It means they can survive for months. For months mean what? Two months, three months, four months, but not, uh, not uh, indicating one month. Without food, while they're protecting their eggs. Okay, let's go to the next part. This one is long, but not um, very difficult, right? Easy. Alligators ever attack people? Yes, and you should be wary of them. However, they're not as aggressive as crocodiles. Alligator attacks are rare, and deaths are even rarer. For example, since 1948, only around 20 people have been killed by alligators in Florida. In fact, alligators have more to fear from humans than we do from them. People sometimes steal their eggs for alligator farms. People also eat alligator meat and use their skins to make leather products. However, most alligators used by people are raised on farms. Also, it's estimated that there are about a million American alligators in the wild. The Chinese alligator, however, is endangered. It lives in the Yangtze River, and it's believed that only a few dozen remain. Here's a picture of one. Um, what is this part talking about? This part is talking about whether the alligators attack people or not. Do alligators ever attack people? What does ever mean, ever? Ever means uh, at any time. Yes, you should be wary of them. Wary. What does that mean, wary? Wary means be cautious because it might be dangerous. However, they're not as aggressive as crocodiles. 